so in this video we are going to see a recruitment news from DRDO there is a recruitment for apprentice again actually there are various laboratories and various branches of DRDO and all these branches are actually calling for apprentice mainly for uh, graduate and diploma apprentice okay so here here the branch of DRDO that is defense bioengineering and electromedical laboratory that is DEBEL is recruiting for the post of apprentice again graduate and technician apprentice they are recruiting so we are going to see all details in this video okay so let us see the post details first so they are recruiting for graduate apprentice with 18 vacancies and diploma or technician apprentice with four vacancies let us see the branch details and branch wise vacancy details for mechanical branch that is for graduate apprentice first we are going to see the branches for graduate apprentice the first branch they are recruiting is mechanical with six vacancy electronics and electronics and communication with four vacancy biomedical with four vacancy biotechnology with two vacancy computer science slash it that is computer science or it combined together two vacancies okay so that is the branch wise vacancy details for graduate apprentice next is for technician or diploma apprentice there is four vacancies the branches they are calling out mechanical with two vacancies and electrical electronics and electronics and communication combined two vacancies okay so these are the branch wise vacancy details next is a qualification requirement so the qualification for graduate apprentice is b or b tech and diploma in engineering for the respective branches is a qualification requirement for the diploma apprentice okay and candidate should not have undergone apprenticeship training elsewhere they have mentioned specifically in the notification and also the candidate should not have any previous work experience also candidate should not have completed three years after engineering and diploma okay so if you have completed your graduation or a uh, diploma three years ago then you are not eligible okay maximum two years if you if you had to have exceeded uh, three years means you are not eligible okay the duration of apprenticeship is for one year and the stipend they are providing is 9000 rupees for graduate trainee or graduate apprentice and 8000 rupees per month for the diploma and the technician apprentice okay so that is the stipend details the age limit they have not actually mentioned but they have mentioned regarding the the years after your graduation or diploma okay next is the application procedure so the application procedure first you have to enroll yourself to MHRD NAS GOV dot inside that is the first procedure that you have to do after that along with the notification you can see an application form you have to take a printout of the application form you have to fill up and then again scan the application form and convert to a PDF format and then along with the necessary certificates like educational certificate date of birth proof that can be your 10th certificate or any valid certificate for date of birth proof then caste certificate if applicable all these things that is the certificates and the application form should be combined together as a single pdf file and then you have to mail to the given mail id okay so that is the application procedure i'll tell it once again the application form you can find towards the end of this notification you have to take a printout and fill up again scan and convert that to a pdf file then you have to also scan your educational qualification certificate your date of birth proof your cas certificate if applicable so all these things you have to scan and convert to pdf form and combine all these documents together and then mail to the given mail id okay so that is the application procedure next selection procedure so there is no selection uh, procedures as such you just have to apply based on your mark that you are that you have obtained in your graduation that is engineering or and diploma you will be shortlisted okay so that is the only selection procedure there is no interview or there is no examination as such and also there is no fees for applying okay so all these things we have discussed in this video the uh, the qualification details the post details vacancy stipend duration of training everything we have discussed and also the application procedure and selection procedure so if you are having a graduation that is engineering and uh, if you have a diploma in this respective branches you can always try your luck you, if you are interested in doing apprenticeship jobs a lot of openings are actually coming not this this one but a lot of openings are actually coming okay so 
first see the notification in detail if you think that you are eligible please do apply for it as soon as possible okay and also the last date they have not mentioned any last date as such but the last date will be 15 days after this notification has been published okay so there is time so please do see the notification and apply fast okay don't wait till 15 days please apply for it as soon as possible okay so if you found the video useful please do give it a thumbs up please do share it with all your friends who are eligible and if you want more videos please do subscribe to the channel thanks for watching and keep on watching